Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, class of 2020 students and their parents. Of course, this is, depends on when you are watching this video. I wish I could speak to you all in your graduation ceremony, but due to the pandemic, I'm sending my message with, the, with, with this video clip. Everything was great and uh, at the expected pace until the spring break. We were very close to the finish line. We had only two and a half months for the school, but suddenly we met with the COVID-19, which changed our habits and experiences so quickly. Across the world, the virus has forced more than 1 billion students out of school. We know this is temporary and we hope and pray the virus will go away soon. Like all of you, we are also missing our graduation ceremony this year. And we will have a graduation ceremony this fall if the situation gets better. Your high school have a lot of different activities and different experiences. You took lots of different classes and met with different friends. Many teachers you met, you attended extracurricular activities social events, uh, school dances. You had lots of challenges and lots of fun. Now you are graduated from high school and you are an adult now. Sometimes growing can be a little scary as you will be facing new horizons, new responsibilities and different challenges. However, there are meant to be positive new alternatives in your life that's needed for your continuous success. Some of you may stay closer to home this year, but some of you may slightly move further away and, uh, and you, you can be in different uh, places. Wherever you, you may find yourself and uh, whatever challenge you may have chosen to follow and explore, hold true to what shaped your yesterdays, acknowledge and appreciate what you are today and dare to be all that you can be tomorrow. It has been honor and the privilege to watch your progress and success. Good luck and thank you all for the past four years and your parents. We will miss you and I know you will continue to shine in the years ahead. We congratulate you and wish you our best. Stay focused, stay connected, but most importantly, stay safe and enjoy your life. Thank you and God bless you all. Hi seniors, it's Miss Peyton. I'm here addressing you um, for your virtual graduation. Virtually, unfortunately. Um, you're a graduating class unlike any other and the challenges facing you at the moment of your adult life's beginning are fairly significant. History will look back at this moment as one of the most important of its kind. It requires fortitude, action, responsibility, and bravery. I have no doubt that the class of 2020 and your generation will rise to the occasion. Do not go silently to what lies ahead. Embrace your place in history. You are well prepared. Congratulations and the Harmony School of Advancement and myself salute you. Hello, class of 2020. I know this senior year is very far from the traditional experience of a senior. However, I am very impressed with your maturity and patience during this time. The graduating class of 2020 will be known for its resilience through this unexpected and difficult time. One thing I have observed about the class of 2020 is you all have courage. You all have what it takes to change this world for the better. My first year at this school was your freshman year, and since then you all have made a name for yourselves. I am honored that I have had the chance to complete this journey with you all, and I have seen you all go from bliss and clueless freshmen to mature and responsible seniors. I've loved working with you all over, the, over these years. Special shout out to the seniors and student council, step team, and alphas. But I thank all of you for welcoming me this year and helping me start my new heroes activities. You all have really brought the school to life these four years, and I know you all will do great things in the future. As always, please reach out to me if you ever need anything. 
I'm always here for you now and in, into the future. We will love for all of you to come back, visit with us, motivate some of our students um, as you progress into your careers. Congrats, and you all will always be Hawks and Heroes. Bye-bye. First off, I want to say thank you to my family, teachers, and staff for all the guidance they gave me over the last four years. Without their continued support and dedication, none of this would be possible. To the class of 2020, it's been a rough year, to say the least. Our last three months of senior year were cut short by the coronavirus, robbing us of prom, graduation, and whatever else was in store for us. And the worst part is, we never even got to say goodbye. It's a not-so-happy ending to an otherwise very special story. Over the last four years, we strengthened old friendships and made some new ones. We learned together, laughed together, celebrated together, cried together, and ultimately, we grew up together. And those are moments that I will cherish forever. High school has been an unforgettable experience, and I couldn't have asked for a better group of people to share it with than the class of 2020. The future is filled with uncertainty. Our lives post-pandemic might never be the same, but if there's one thing that I am certain of, is that when the dust settles, the class of 2020 will still be standing tall. I'm confident we will emerge from this stronger than ever, because if this doesn't stop us, nothing will. Thank you, and congrats to the class of 2020. <laughs> Congratulations, Harmony graduates of the class of 2020. I am NASA astronaut Laurel O'Hara, and I am honored to congratulate you all on this huge accomplishment. You did it. I know this is a really tough way to end your high school career. You are watching the planet face some of her gravest challenges ever, from an unprecedented global pandemic to a dramatically changing climate, to serious civil unrest on the streets of America. Where do you even start? I grew up in Houston too. Living just down the road from NASA Johnson Space Center inspired me to dream about becoming an astronaut. Chasing that dream led me to study engineering in college where I learned that I love to design and build and test hardware. This led me to a job in ocean science, developing underwater submersibles and robots used to explore some of the most remote places on earth. When I graduated high school, I never would have predicted that I would be working on crazy cool robots in the middle of the ocean. I didn't even know that was a thing you could do. And it took me a pretty long time, like 10 years, to find it. Through it all, there have been ups and downs and things that definitely did not always go as I had hoped. What I've learned though, is that my reaction to those uncertainties and how I choose to handle the situations that come my way, that's what determines how happy I am. That's what determines how successful I am. I can choose to be frustrated or angry or disappointed, or I can choose something else, something good. Life took me, and it will take you too, in very unexpected places. Learn to embrace the change and uncertainty that you will find. Look for the opportunity in every situation instead of dwelling on what you might be missing. Challenge yourself with big goals and then give them your best. But most importantly, don't forget what we have all collectively learned in 2020, that nothing is more important than our health, the health and well-being of our families and friends and our planet our communities, and our willingness to work together and be kind to one another. You are heading out to the world with a perspective that no class before you has ever had. We need fresh voices. We need optimism and energy. We need you. Godspeed, class of 2020. We are so proud of you and cannot wait to see what you accomplish. Abbas Syed Mohammed Abedin Saleh Umar Ahmad Muzamal Ahmed Vicente Alcala Kaylin Trache Allen Michael Anthony Alvarenga 
Khalida Mohammed Amla. Odalise Giselle Angel. Edgar Alonzo Ariza. Lisbeth Janet Aravalo. Ilian Eli Arroyo. Natalia Jania Baker. Sahana Balaji. Karen Barrera. Diego Andres Becerra. Hector Daniel Benavides. Kristen Lee Blog. Quabina Kessi Boadi. Hamza Amir Buder Dabin. Jordan Taylor Brooks. Denodric Roshun Brown. Madison Marie Bukenya. Siana Yvette Caldera. Daniel Tanvan Sao. Melanie Carreno. Julio Cesar Castillo. Daria Satish Chandanani. Congratulations, class of 2020. We've made it. We finally graduated. Not in the way we wanted, but I'd also like to send this out to my parents as a congratulations to them, too. Spencer Cole Chapman. Christian Eliezer Chavez. Umar Zarar Chaudhry. Edward Saeed Coelho. Ariana Renee Coronado. Munavar Josh Kunash. Raimundo Alder Cruz. Ahmed Walid Damani. Jacoby Lucio Davila. Chris De La Torre. Joshua Caleb Derrick. Ryan Lay Ding. Daniel Javier Dominguez. It was a rough four years. It really was at times, but time to move on to bigger and better things. Daoud Musa Duale. Frashani Fasin Fernandez. Teresa Marie Flores. Arnolfo Franco. Kayla Gail Freeman. Big shout out to God and to my whole family for teaching me the foundations to succeed. My celebration is your celebration. Thank you for all you do and here's to college. Emily Gallegos. Jorge Gallegos. Alexander Galvin. Shanik Oday Ganju. Daniel A. Garcia. Gabriel Garcia. Leonardo J. Gomez. 
Diego Alejandro Gonzalez. Enrique Gabriel Gonzalez. Joel Gonzalez. Leslie Jasmine Gonzalez. Dominique Andrea Grayson. Elise Cristal Guerrero. Mario Gia. Jose Antonio Guzman Flores. Tasnuba Tabusan Hawk. Jaden Amir Harris. Bilal Hassan. Maheen Hassan. Bria Liana Enriquez Marquez. David Brian Hernandez. Milka Elizabeth Hernandez. Camille Ilter. Tiana Sanye Jackson. Karenicia Jaina Jones. Iram Fatima Khan. Sadaf Begum Khan. Hi, my name is Sadaf Khan, and I want to let my teachers, parents, and classmates know that without your presence, my graduation wouldn't be complete. And thanks a lot for all the help and encouragement. Pavan Karedi. Randy Lamb. Enith Naomi Landaverdi. Eddie Lee Lane. Jolyn Irie Laud. Thank you guys for giving me a wonderful experience in high school. Um, thanks to my teachers, my friends, and my family. Um, good luck. Catherine Knock Lay. Michelle Priscilla Ledesma. Emmanuel Denver Lewis. Megan Lim. Carlos Enrique Lopez. Gladys Megan Lopez. Martha Susanna Lopez. Violet Renee Lopez. Yobani Joel Lopez. Anthony Luna. Jacqueline Mendoza. Asia Mahmoud Mubarak. Natalie Molina. Mackenzie Moten. Emily Denise Mercia. Ivy Ting Nguyen. John Michael Nieto. Logan Renzo Ormsby. Mariam Hanif Patel. Rhea Vipal Patel. Terry Morgan Phoenix. David Adoram Ponce. 
Svetalina Marie Porcio. Jamil Rajan. Melody Giovanna Ramirez. Fatima Paula Refugio. Karen Lynn Reyna. Lizette Rodriguez. Sandra Rodriguez. Ivan Carlos Rodriguez Oliveros. Jared Rojas. Sergio Arturo Roman. Olivia Lynette Roski. Diego Alexander Rubio. Alexander Saavedra. Cecilia Saavedra. Juan Adolfo Sanchez. Kevin Giovanni Saravia. I want to thank everybody. Fatima Syed. Omar Syed. Swapnil Sharia. April Ellen Sheffield. Vincent Richard Smith. Elizabeth Claire Stevens. Derek Ray Taylor. Andrew Edward Todar. Eric Tran. Tammy Tang Tran. Ty Anthony Tran. Lei Man Truong. Gerlin Garamayas Vega Garcia. Anne Tian Vu. Dariana Shanae Wynn. Hey there, class of 2020. It's Mr. Rudolph. I'm just uh, here. I wish I could be here in uh, person, but unfortunately, this is the situation that we're in. Just wanted to say congratulations again on your graduation. I think that you guys have shown incredible energy, creativity, imagination, and a whole lot of sense of humor, and just so much heart here the, this past semester. Just wanted to say that I wish you guys the very best, and I know that you're going to do amazing things in the future. Take care. Hello, class 2020. Congratulations on your graduation. You guys made it, even though it's a tough year for all of us. So we went through. Again, congratulations and best wish for you on your new academic adventure. Thank you. God bless. Congratulations, 2020 graduates. Here's Miss Arius, just wanting to tell you that I'm so, so proud of you for making it through all these years. I have so many wonderful memories with you from ninth grade, 10th grade, 11th and 12th grade. Um, my piece of advice for you when you go to college is to continue to work hard, be responsible and just enjoy the process. Hi everyone, this is Mr. Murat, your AP Calculus College Prep and CT teacher. I have enjoyed the time I taught you this year. I hope that this new beginning will bring you whatever you wish to have. I hope your new life will be what you want it to be. I say so because I know you deserve this. Good luck. Thank you. <laughs>